Hey guys, good morning. I look really bad. But I'm about to make my coffee and I don't know if you guys saw in the last vlog but there's this Cadbury cream egg creamer and I tried it in hot coffee and it didn't really taste like anything. So we're going to try it in cold coffee because I feel like you're able to taste stuff more in cold coffee. There's Kappa in my sink. You want some water, buddy? Okay. Mmm. It smells good. It smells better than the first time, I feel like. This is my same cup from yesterday. I wash them and reuse them. Um, cheers. It kind of tastes like the Oreo one. I don't know, it's nothing special. The one that I like the best between the Oreo, the Cadbury cream and the turtles is definitely the turtles. So I'm trying to feed the cats like this like real chicken food that has to stay in the fridge and stuff and like no one's really eating it i mean sephora's kind of smelling it i don't know if she's finally eating it but oh i think she's eating it but kappa will not eat it luna will not eat it i don't know i'm just kind of gonna leave it there and see if they end up liking it or maybe mix it with the real food or something Here's a little sneak peek on how I make my iced coffee. I think I've talked about this before on my channel, but just to read, show you guys what I do. So I have this Keurig, it's called the Duo. What it can do, it can either do a pod at the top right here, or it could do a cup of coffee. I meant cups of coffee, which you could put your own grounds in right here. And it comes with this tray to put your coffee grounds in. And then it also comes with this pot to brew the coffee in. So what I do is I literally use this if I'm going to make iced coffee or if like it really helps when like Josh's parents are over or if I'm like hosting a dinner or like a breakfast or like a brunch. It helps so much instead of using like 10 pods, which is like so pricey. I could just brew a whole pot of coffee. Um, so what I do is I press the pot button. I pick 12 strong because I like my coffee strong. You don't have to if you don't want to. And then I brew it. And then after this gets filled, I put it in the fridge and there's my iced coffee for like the next like five days. Or most of the time like three because me and Josh both have one every day. So it like lasts like three days. But if it's just you by yourself, it could probably last you four to five days. And that's it. The devil's up. Says you. What do you mean says me? I've been up. Yeah, but you just kept coming in. Because I wanted waking. to kiss you. Yeah, right. No, you went in just to annoy me. How do you think I feel now? Now you know how I feel. What do you mean? I don't, I don't, I don't purposely wake you up. Okay. Uh, what? Two days ago. What? What happened? Actually, on Monday, you woke up at what time? I don't know, 8 o'clock, and then I was like, do you want me to come with you? And you were like, yeah. The only reason why I was up is because you left the door wide open. And I heard the cats meowing. So learn to be a heavier sleeper. Or learn to shut the door and respect people sleeping. <laughs> How about that? Mm -hmm. There's the gas station where we almost got caught for stealing. You mean, no, technically- I told them Technically, the story. they almost got caught for stealing. That's true, it wasn't you know our fault. Saying? Like, I don't know, even though I technically only stole about 90 cents, like, bro, like, get your shit right. Well, I thought maybe he just typed in 56 instead of 55. So I thought, oh, maybe, cause like it's right next to each other. Mm. Anyways. We're going to try and find mirrors. I need to go to Joseph's Produce because I really want salad today because my body is like falling apart and I'm constipated. I can't poop. Don't laugh. Stop I had laughing. to help her put on her baby clothes today. No, I have a, <laughs> I have a, like a little body suit on. And he thinks that I look like a baby with a onesie on. <laughs> it does look like a baby though. He had to do the clipping. Yeah, that's what, that's the baby part. Like the clipping part, super baby. So what? <laughs> And yeah, I need to get potatoes. Ah! Babe. Sorry. I think this is the most I've used my crock pot since I've got it. I've had to use it like almost every single day for something. But yeah, anyways, talk to you guys later. Bye.
Okay, so I've talked about breakfast burritos from McDonald's before. I remade them and I freeze them. I freeze them in huge batches so I can use them throughout the week. So what you're going to need is breakfast sausages. You're going to need to cook that first and then you're going to need to just scramble some eggs. Then you're going to need a can of diced tomatoes with green chilies or you can get a can of green chilies and then a can of diced tomatoes. Mix it all together with the sausage, the egg, and that. Get tortillas, put a slice of cheese on it, roll it up, and there you go. Also, to freeze, all you have to do is wrap it in a paper towel and shove it in a freezer bag. Wrap them individually so they don't all stick together. And yeah, sorry that I had to do this so fast. Um, I was recording in the middle of like unpacking the house. Just Guys, I'm editing the vlog right now, and I just want to let y'all know, anyone that's been waiting for the outro song that you hear at, at the end of every vlog that is officially releasing on April 29th this month, what is that, like, two weeks from now? So, y'all have to get ready for that. It's finally coming out. It's going to be on my channel. Um, I'm going to upload it on my channel, uh, which is just Jbish, and then I'm gonna up it's going to be on Spotify, Apple Music, everywhere anywhere that you listen to music on is gonna be there so please go check it out i'm gonna remind y'all too a little bit closer but i just wanted to stop this so i can remind y'all okay guys i am home i got this lamp from home sense to put on my desk area and i just gotta put a light bulb in it we have some loose light bulbs laying around the house and i think it'd be really good for when i'm live to like have a extra um light this is so cute for only 40 dollars, and it has like this <laughs> Kappa. And it has like this really cool cord. I got some Himalayan salt because I am out of it. And then I got two mirrors for our bathroom. I got two of these ones. So I'm going to put those up today. And what else did I get? Oh yeah, Josh got some substrate for his snake. And there's Luna eating Sephora's ass. Okay, so I'm eating um, a bagel with cream cheese. I have Kappa sitting with me while I eat. I know a lot of you guys think it's gross, but I love my cats. I don't care. I'll literally make out with him. I don't care. <laughs> I literally love him. I don't care. I would literally be okay if he stepped on my face. I don't care. I love him so much. I don't care if any of them are on the couch. Okay guys, so this is hopefully my foam panels to put on the ceiling to make it a little bit more soundproof in here and not so echoey. As you guys see, that's all that I got done because I ran out of rolls. Um, I, know, I mean, I have some rolls here, but they won't stick on the wall. So um, I had to order more. But yeah, let's open this and see what it looks like. So these are the foam panels. I have about six of them. I think they're like two feet long. I'm waiting for the pink ones. And then I'm going to have Sick come over and put them all along the walls. Josh is making a song if you guys can't hear. Hey guys, so update. As I was putting up the mirrors, Josh accidentally dropped one and broke it. So we're going to go return it and return the other one. Or maybe see if they have another one that we can exchange it for. Because I really like the mirrors. Like I really, really do like them. But those are the last two that we could see. So we're going to ask if maybe they have some in the back. If not, we're going to have to wait till like another week to see when they restock at HomeSense and find more mirrors. Josh got a nail in his tire. So we're here dropping off his bike right now. Um, yeah, because he was taking out his bike to go for a ride. And then it, uh, there was literally a nail on the ground and it went right in his tire perfectly. Yeah, that was sick. Um... But this guy's doing it for a really good price, and he said it's gonna be ready one by like three. Yeah, so that's yeah, good. Three. It's really nice out today. It's starting to get hot. It's about to get. It's about to get way hotter too. Yeah, it was just blizzarding like two days ago, but whatever. Guys, look what Josh got me. Well, they can't see. Where's the? Uh, where you put? Oh. Look, it's a little cover for the Xbox controller. So I just got us. Some fruit and vegetables from Joseph's Produce. We have some romaine lettuce. This is always good for salads. Some potatoes for tonight's dinner. And it's also my favorite vegetable of like all time. Um, some onions because I have no onions left. And I could always use some onions in all my cooking. A cucumber to add into our salads and to eat as a snack. And then some mangoes. Oh my goodness. And it feels so nice on my hands. 
Wow, thank you, baby. Okay, guys, I'm just putting dinner in the crock pot real quick so I can finish going on with my day. As you guys know, I do not have a stove still, so this is my stove for the week. That's why I've been making everything in a crock pot. I have chicken thighs and potatoes. You guys have probably seen me make this before. It's probably one of my favorite meals. Um, you can use any chicken, chicken breast, chicken legs, anything. With potatoes, I have thyme, parsley, and a little bit of oregano in there. You could use basil. You could use anything you want. I highly just recommend focusing on the thyme. It's what makes this dish so good. I have some leftover butter. You could use a stick. You could use half a stick. You can use none. You can use oil. You can use whatever you want. Just use some type of fat. So I just like to put whatever leftover stick of butter I have. A crap ton of garlic. If you don't have garlic, you can use garlic salt. You can use garlic powder. Just don't add salt later. And then um, I have this, which I got from Hannah um, from my Patreon. I love her. She got me this for Christmas. And I'm just going to add some salt and pepper in there. And then cover it up and let it cook. And then I add ranch and Parmesan cheese at the end. And it is so fire. It's my favorite meal. Cassidy loves it. I love it. Josh doesn't really love chicken thighs but i do so i'm just gonna mix this around and then start it on the crock pot on low or high whatever okay guys i know it doesn't look very clean but me and josh you guys should have saw before i don't know if you guys saw before but we basically cleaned it to the best of our ability right now with the stuff that we have i mean obviously there's a lot of stuff that needs to be put away i just ate off that plate i had some uh grape leaves from a um place in my city but um yeah so that needs to be obviously taken care of that over there needs to be taken care of. All of those bins need to be taken care of. All of that needs to be taken care of. But we made it at least walkable, livable, I guess you should say. My room is a fucking disaster. Look at my room. Yeah, I'm gonna clean that next. But first, hey, <laughs> hey, Kappa. But first, I am going to do a house tour. Um, for my patreon i'm gonna do a little house tour for today's video and then i'm gonna edit and upload that and edit and upload a vlog as well and then i'll probably get back to cleaning and cleaning my room and everything but oh, i'm so tired me and josh have just been non-stop for like a week unpacking and it's just oh, it's just a lot <laughs> hey guys it is now five o'clock p.m and i just finished uploading my patreon video um, and I'm gonna have a little bit of a nap. I'm really like worn down I think from just moving me and Josh have basically been non-stop like doing stuff from like Seven and like today. I woke up at seven From like every day from around 7 to 8 to like 11 p.m Just non-stop like unpacking or going to the store to get something or hanging something up or doing a project and I'm just so tired like all of that mixed with working is just killing me obviously i haven't been working as much because i've been focusing on the house but now that like the hard parts are over and like i have a room to sleep in, i have a kitchen i'm like balancing work and relaxing and i'm also balancing unpacking like i'm, I'm not rushing to unpack stuff because all of the other stuff that i haven't unpacked yet are just like little decorations or just things that really aren't important right now so um, I'm just taking my time, but you know what? I haven't had a nap. Actually, I have had one nap here um, and it was like a four hour nap, but I really just feel like in order for me to focus and like do more for the day, I'm gonna need to nap. Cause like I ha I'm like in one of those moods where it's like, I just wanna sit and like watch something like without my brain doing something, you know? So I think that's what I'm gonna do. I'm honestly just gonna sit down and uh, try and have a nap because I don't think I can do this anymore. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna be able, able to edit my vlog properly if I don't have a nap. And I don't think I'm gonna be able to work or unpack anymore. Like if I don't have a nap, I'm just gonna sit there and like go on my phone. So I might as well nap and then wake up and be functionable again. So I really need to clean my room. I really need to start unpacking the makeup table. I need a spray tan. I need to wax my eyebrows. So I'm gonna turn on the wax and then have a nap. And then by the time I wake up, my wax should be cooled off so yeah hey guys so it's been a couple days as you can see i have zits on my face your girl pms really bad i was having a really bad week um but before i end this video i just want to talk about the giveaway you might see in the title i am doing a 500 dollar giveaway over on patreon um all you have to do is be a member um you're paying 
for the videos anyways you're not paying for the giveaway you're just paying for the videos so there's over 100 videos um and there's over like 50 lives that you can go back and watch and i'm also recording my podcast now with video footage so if you're a 10 or 20 dollar tier you're able to see that as well um and yeah, so if you guys want to come and join my lives and get to know me a little bit better and see over 100 videos, there's some about finances, how to buy your first house, um, all about my fertility, my sex life, everything like that, my first time, go check that out. Um, but yeah, I literally just ended up sleeping, so that's why I didn't get to finish the video, but I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I've been vlogging a lot more now that the house is put together. I took like a week off to like put the house together, but I've been vlogging a lot more, so there should be videos about every day or if not... Um, every other day so keep that in mind and podcasts are going to be uploaded on my channel with video footage so it's going to be one hour video footage Savora, can you stop like anyways i love you guys thank you so much for watching thank you so much for sticking around i also have a house tour over on patreon if you want to go watch my house tour you guys can go check that out i love you guys thank you so much for watching bye don't take no time off bad bitch tripping she throwing my vibe off flooding in diamonds that must shine when you turn the light off no she gon' ride yeah yeah she be screaming when i'm up inside yeah she don't get tired she come to the crib i don't gotta invite yeah don't take no time off bad bitch tripping she throwing my vibe off flooding in diamonds that must shine when you turn the light off no she gon' ride yeah